He was an explorer in Australia in the mid-19th century, known for his extensive exploration of the interior of Queensland and northern New South Wales. He was recognized as the assistant surveyor of New South Wales, working closely with Sir Thomas Mitchell. He made significant contributions to the field of exploration and geography. His name is Edmund Besley Court Kennedy J.P. In the annals of Australian exploration, the name Edmund Besley Court Kennedy J.P. stands as a testament to the indomitable spirit of adventure and discovery. Born in the early 19th century, Kennedy would go on to become an assistant surveyor of New South Wales, working alongside the renowned explorer Sir Thomas Mitchell. With a thirst for knowledge and a desire to uncover the mysteries of the vast Australian continent, Kennedy embarked on numerous expeditions that would forever shape the understanding of the region. His exploration journeyed into the interior of Queensland and northern New South Wales, traversing through rugged landscapes and uncharted territories. Among the notable rivers he explored were the Thompson River, the Barku River, Cooper Creek, and the mighty Cape York Peninsula. These expeditions were not without challenges, as Kennedy faced treacherous terrains, unpredictable weather conditions, and encounters with the indigenous Aboriginal Australians who inhabited the land. Tragically, Kennedy's exploratory endeavors came to a premature end in December 1848. During an expedition near Cape York in far north Queensland, he was speared by Aboriginal Australians, succumbing to his injuries. His untimely death marked the end of a promising career and left a void in the world of Australian exploration. Despite his untimely demise, Edmund Kennedy's contributions to the exploration of Australia's interior cannot be overstated. His fearless spirit and unwavering determination laid the foundation for future explorers to follow in his footsteps. His expeditions, though cut short, provided valuable insights into the geography, flora, and fauna of the region. The impact of Kennedy's explorations extended far beyond his own time. His findings and discoveries opened up new possibilities for settlement, trade, and development in the vast and untamed lands of Australia. His legacy continues to inspire generations of adventurers, igniting a flame of curiosity and courage in all who dare to venture into the unknown. In the annals of Australian exploration, the name Edmund Besley Court Kennedy J.P. will forever be remembered as a pioneer who fearlessly ventured into the uncharted territories of the continent, leaving an indelible mark on the history of exploration and the world at large. Born on Guernsey in the Channel Islands, young Edmund Kennedy showed promise from an early age. Educated at Elizabeth College Guernsey, he developed a keen interest in surveying. In 1839, Kennedy set sail for Sydney on the Bark Globe, arriving in March 1840. Through family connections, he secured a position as an assistant surveyor in the New South Wales Survey Department. Kennedy's career took an unfortunate turn when he became involved with an Irish convict girl named Margaret Murphy, resulting in scandal and his recall to Sydney in disgrace. Despite this setback, Kennedy's surveying skills were recognized by Superintendent Charles Latrobe and Governor Gipps, and he remained employed in the government surveying department in Sydney, albeit at half pay. If you want to discover more adventurers on YouTube, make sure to hit that subscribe button for my channel, and don't forget to leave a comment in the section below, telling us which adventurers you'd like us to feature next.